Here's what I really think of Montenegro. The song is called Space and it's sung by Slavko Kalesvik. Sorry if I got that wrong. I know I got that wrong. So from the get-go, I felt like I stepped into some kind of gay club with this music. It was very... that kind of sound. I actually really liked this song as it was a different style compared to all the others. The songs for this year have all been very similar. It's been kind of dark and with strings and this was more dancey and I'm not really a dance kind of person but I did like this one. The chorus would have been perfect if it wasn't for the trumpets coming into it. It was like like a big band sound in the chorus of a dance club sound. It didn't match at all and I thought what is with this live band sound this year? We stopped having live music for Eurovision in 1998 and people were against it or for it but if you don't want it in the competition why are you making the song sound like big band? So it would have been perfect if it had more beats and less outdated trumpet sounds. Slavko is very different but in a good way. I think the Montenegrin stylists will have a field trip with him and be like yes what can we do what can we do to show off our abilities with this guy because he's quite enjoyable to look at. He has a very good stage presence he performs really well and I think that he's fun and the song is very fun and he lets off a fun vibe but I don't have a problem with that if the song is really good and the song is really good it's really sophisticated particularly in the song I liked the verses more than the chorus and there's an outro chorus that I really liked as well <laughs> This will be great performed live on stage. I can see the audience already dancing away, feeling like they're in a club, and it's just going to be lots of fun. I don't know how they'll go. Montenegro, it's interesting, Montenegro's videos usually do really well on YouTube. If there's any way to decipher how well a country will go based off their YouTube views, Montenegro would probably win like every year, but they don't always do so well. Last year they didn't make it into the final at all, and so I'm not sure how they'll go. It seems to be well perceived, though I'm not sure. Unfortunately, Montenegro, this is not what I'm saying, but a lot of countries don't think of Montenegro at the end unless they were really wowed by the song. And I think this could be the case where someone could be wowed and it could get sent to the final. So... I think it could get to the final as a final worthy performance, but of course we shall see. Here's my leadership board to see where Montenegro is at. Remember my countries can change in position as time goes on. And that's it for now. Please remember to like, comment and most importantly subscribe to see all my review videos. And until next time, bonsoir Europe and goodbye.